Hello everyone, welcome to another episode here, our world's most endangered turtle species. We're looking at QR Yunnanensis. Unlike the last species, we actually know where this one came from, right there in Yunnan province, close to the capital Kunming. Um, the crazy thing was, this was described in 1904, and then, or 1906, and then there wasn't really any more found after 1920. It was presumed to be extinct until 2004 rolls around. There's one in a market there in Kunming. So that close to a huge city and no one saw them. So that just gives a testament to how well they can hide in their habitat. Anyways, another one came out about a year later, male and female. They're actually at the Kunming Institute of Zoology now and they've bred before and they went out in 2008. Kadori Farm Botanical Gardens in Kunming. They went out and actually found a small population. So they collected some, they brought them in captivity. They've had some success in captive breeding, but not as much as we had hoped. But there is hope for this species since we know where they came from. We know the habitat's still there, and we're captive breeding them. Um, there's only, there's less than 100 of these species, 100 individuals of this species in captivity. And then after about 2008, when they went out there, they didn't really find a lot more. But the big thing is they found more, some Turtle hunters found them back in 2017, 2018, and maybe about another 20 individuals were collected at a different site. So there could be more, but we haven't seen any since about 2019. But there could be another site somewhere there in Yunnan. We tried to go find them. Unfortunately, we didn't find any. Matter of fact, we had one. They said, yeah, we found a turtle. It looks like that. We got excited, and it turned out to be a red eared slider. So <laughs> it, it wasn't a successful trip, but we know they used to be there. We know they used to be in a couple more areas than normal, but they've just been wiped out. So they did have a bigger range just at one site. And this is kind of what their habitat looks like. Small mountain streams, cool water mountain streams, beautiful habitat. Hopefully we'll find some more in the wild before it's too late.